All right, good morning, uh, Friday. So come out, I didn't think there was that much snow, um, but we got, I don't know, maybe three, three, four inches of the heavy wet stuff. So I did the driveway real quick. Um, plan on working on those floor joists today, uh, on the Friday, maybe get that done today. We'll see how that goes. Um, and then uh, take a couple of days off from the cabin build. Um, so thanks for watching. Ah, first time up in the morning here and all this is, iced on so i had those problems yesterday with the camera getting wet so hopefully i could just cut this cart and put it if i put my phone right in there hopefully it'll keep the uh rain off of it see if that works So I decided I'm going to move all the skins out of here. Should have done it before the snow, obviously, but now that I'm putting these floor joists in, um, there's not going to be a whole lot of space and I am going to have to crawl under there. I plan to put like a vapor barrier down. So I'll just get everything out from under the cabin and just have it dirt, I think is the best. So first I'll remove the snow and then I'll try to get the peels out. So anyway, my video shut off. Um, I got the peels, a couple of peel piles there. I just removed those um, from under the cabin. Um, someone's probably gonna say, well, that's actually beneficial uh, to have under your cabin. I have read that certain types of peels are to keep moisture and whatnot, bugs away or something like that. But I just don't know about uh, these spruce peels. So I just wanted to clear it out a little bit for these floor joists so I could have room to work under the joists if I have to get under there for any reason with a vapor barrier or something like that but all right we'll start on the floor joist now Thank you. 
Well, this uh, should be going a lot easier, but I got this second log over here that's higher, that's further in than the bottom log. So everyone, I just got to trim after I cut it because it's that two different sitting on two logs. So it's right in the gap. Uh, I definitely would have did it differently if I had done it again. Um, I'm probably going to run a little board under the edge instead of hangers. Maybe I'll get hangers. I don't know. They're like a buck a piece. Um, I might get hangers for the underside of each one, but I just wanted to get them in here straight first um, and then put the hangers on second. So I'm going to go warm up. It's wet today and then uh, get some food, dry out. Things are going a little slower today, but that's all right. We'll keep trucking. All righty. Thanks for watching. All right, well, changed my clothes. Got dry gear on. The rain has slowed. It's warmed right up. Um, so I'm moving a little faster now once I got this down. Um, and we should, we should get there. We're halfway right here, almost halfway. So, so like five more across. Doing a standard 16 inch on center um, between my floor joists and yeah, should be pretty good. all right there we go got it done just before dark yeah i was my milwaukee batteries were dying and wasn't sure i was gonna get it done but just had enough juice um so it's pretty level we'll see i've seen them do this in the the big show so oh no oh, i think the uh that little end thing flipped down on the other end, see. I think they're pretty level. Should I try it again? Let me try it again. Cut. Okay, let's try it again. Are they level? Mm, is it level? Ooh, not 100%, but we're gonna call that good for today. All right, well, thanks for watching. Uh, it was a good week. Um, yeah, got a lot done. I can't even remember. I have to go back and watch these videos. So it's really nice to, not just for YouTube, to, you know, have others entertained by it, hopefully, but also it's nice to just go back and look at what we did, what, what got accomplished in the week. So kind of a video journal. So yeah, great week. Happy Friday. Have a good weekend. And uh, we'll see you next week. All right. Thanks for watching.